What's up guys, Ace of Masters here today with a new mock, this time on my Skull Scorpio revamp. So first thing I want to say is that this is not a perfect mock by any means. See, there, there's multiple things here that's going wrong, like such as for the legs, you can see there's the black things. I want to have those silver, but I couldn't do that, along with the pincers. But this is not meant to be perfect, this is just meant to be, you know, an overall step up from the original set. And just an, a nice revamp. So now we'll go ahead and take a look. So one of the main things I want to get off with this guy was the function. I didn't really like the original function that they had on Skull Scorpio, so I completely redid it. I went from scratch, and I made it all CCBS, which makes it extremely poseable. And it works just as well being able to go back and forth as you guys can see and it also maintains the friction gears so it can maintain a pose if you want it in a certain angle it's just an overall kind of step up from the original one of the main things that i wanted to um get with this mock is that i can pull off the mask of the toas just like on the actual sets that you can pull them off so for this guy i use this piece on the tail so I can just pull it off like so and it works just as well on the official sets while still overall having a completely different function one thing I do want to note is that there are two open ball joints on the end there right next to the tail and also that I pretty much used the exact same body that Lego had used for the official set so it is very similar in certain ways, like the actual body is pretty much tear right off with slight differences to make the function work. And I just wanted to note that also you can see I do have the neck extended out that just makes the set look a little bit better and I think it just you know overall adds to the revamp. So that is pretty much it for my Skull Scorpio revamp. Overall, I'm very happy with how this came out. The only, you know, problems to me is that, obviously, as I mentioned earlier, I don't like the legs or the pincers because I just don't like the color that they kind of ended up being. But other than that, I am very satisfied. I think that this would have been much better and also much more reasonable. The only real difference to me is that this obviously would not have fit within the price bracket. This obviously would have had to been more around $25 or something just due to a bunch of more parts coming from the legs and the overall, you know, just the pincers and this function. But let me know what you guys think about in the comments. I'd love to see some of your guys' revamps. Until next time, I'll see you guys later. Goodbye.